aim to determine the enthalpy of neutralization of a strong acid hcl with a strong base naoh materials required laboratory stand calorimeter cotton wool stirrer small wooden block beaker 250 ml beaker 500 ml measuring cylinder 100 ml 1 m hcl 100 ml 1 m naoh 100 ml thermometer 110 degree celsius procedure make a setup of a calorimeter take an expanded wooden box and fill it with cotton wool transfer 100 ml of 1 molar hydrochloric acid into the beaker using the measuring cylinder place the hydrochloric acid solution into the calorimeter measure the initial temperature of the hydrochloric acid and record the data t1 degree celsius Now transfer 100 ml of 1 molar sodium hydroxide solution in 250 ml beaker using the measuring cylinder. Now measure the initial temperature of the base sodium hydroxide and record the data same as T1 degree Celsius. Wait for some time for both solutions to attain the constant temperature. 28 degree celsius Now pour the sodium hydroxide solution into the calorimeter that contains 100 ml of HCl Place the stirrer inside the calorimeter Close it and stir the mixture well measure the maximum temperature of the reaction mixture and note it as the final temperature t2 degree celsius observation the initial temperature of the acid and base t1 degree celsius 28 degree celsius the final temperature after neutralization T two degree Celsius, forty degree Celsius. Change in temperature delta T, T one minus T two degree Celsius. Mass of the mixture solution after neutralization, two hundred grams. The water equivalent of a calorimeter, WG. Calculation. Enthalpy change during neutralization of 100 ml of 1 molar HCl is equal to 200 multiplied by W multiplied by T1 minus T2 multiplied by 4.18 where W is the calorimeter constant of the value of 29.1 J value depends on the calorimeter When 1000 ml of 1 molar HCl is allowed to neutralize 1000 ml of 1 molar NaOH calculate the heat that is released This amount would be 10 times greater than what was achieved So enthalpy of neutralization of strong acid and base is equal to 200 multiplied by W multiplied by T1 minus T2 multiplied by 4.18 whole upon 1.0 multiplied by 1000 upon 100 joules is equal to 200 multiplied by W multiplied by T1 minus T2 multiplied by 4.18 whole upon 1.0 multiplied by 100 kilojoules.
is equal to 200 multiplied by 29.1 multiplied by 28 minus 40 multiplied by 4.18 whole upon 1.0 multiplied by 100 kilojoules. Enthalpy of neutralization of strong acid and base is equal to 2919.32 kilojoules. Result Enthalpy change in neutralizing strong acid, hydrochloric acid, with base sodium hydroxide is 2919 kilojoule mole per minus 1. Precautions the heat changes may occur due to the changes in environmental radiation. For thermal insulation, cotton should be used. The mixture of hydrochloric acid and sodium hydroxide should be stirred carefully. Carefully record the temperature of mixture and individuals.